Hi, welcome back to my uh, aircraft site. Uh, what you see before you is a uh, Etihad uh, A380. This aircraft is uh, very, very popular, and as you know, uh, unfortunately, Etihad do not fly these aircraft anymore due to uh, the new A350s are coming into the fleet now. So. Uh, at the time, uh, this F380 was the only aircraft in the world to have an executive uh, residence uh, on the top deck at the very front. You could personalize your own butler, whether you wanted a lady or a, or a man. And also, uh, it came at a great cost. You were paid uh, 20,000 uh, pounds with a return, which is a bit above my uh, bank account, unfortunately. I'll never see that, but. Uh, for those that ever used that facility, it would have been pampered right from the moment they checked in to the moment they stepped off the aircraft uh, wherever the destination was. The F380, as you know, carries over 500 people plus, but each airline has configured uh, their own F380 to their own uh, specifications. Basically, moving on to the second F380 now. This uh, airline has got a special colour scheme, Year of Zaid, celebrating the founder of the Emirates uh, at the time. Apparently, the United, apparently Emirates also had this on their own aircraft, as well as uh, Etihad. Basically, these aircraft are, as you can see, are basically long haul aircraft and uh, have been seen all over the world in the past, as well as at Heathrow, New York, San Francisco, JFK, to name many other airports uh, around the world. But uh, these are my two large uh, 1-200 F380s that I'm showing you this afternoon. I have another one, but unfortunately the table is too small to put all three on here, but uh, they are in very similar color schemes. I will be bringing you uh, in the future, a few more of my Etihad collection, but I hope you've enjoyed uh, what I've told you about them, and uh, I hope you enjoy the rest of your day or your evening. Thank you very much.